So, hello there. I'm standing outside here in Saint Marie at the, at the center, the roundabout here, and the bridge, which is very busy by the old market. And the police are here every day, stopping people on motorbikes. I just want to ask the gentleman, policeman. Hello. How are you? Um, so why why are you stopping people? What what are they doing? What is the mistake? Just no helmet? Yes. That's it. So helmet. So if, if you have helmet, it's okay. Yes. You, don't... you don't stop. Yes. Just helmet. Yes. Okay. And uh, one more and sign. Oh, over there. I'm going and, uh, no left turn. Okay, so you cannot turn left over there, right? Yes. So people turn left yes. and then they make mistake and then you. Okay, so I understand. Yeah, they they have to. Many people do not know the sign, that's the problem. Um, how much does it cost? How much do they have to pay? Dollar? 25. 25? What? How much? Okay. Alright, thank you very much. So yeah, just had a quick chat with the police. You're busy. The problem is over there there's a there's a main road that runs up and you're not supposed to turn left onto this bridge. But people do it all the time because it's easy. I don't know why you're not turning left, I guess it's to enable the traffic from the other side flowing easier. But So people who turn left there illegally, it says don't turn left, you know, there's a sign there clearly. And then also people who don't wear helmets, they stop them here all the time. And I think, I think well, I got stopped myself once in Campot and that was fine $15. So that's the traffic, those are the traffic rules and regulations. Um, we Westerners tend to know them because we all, we all had driving tests and written ones and so on. So we know the, it's our obligation to know the, the, the road rules, right? But the problem in Cambodia is that uh, you don't need a driving license to drive a motorbike under 125cc. And it's 95, 95% of the people do that, drive these motorbikes and have no license. So that causes a bit of a problem. And I don't really understand why these people, these mostly locals actually, young kids going to work, I don't understand why they're that silly, because they know, they know that they're going to get stopped. They know that the police hang out here every single day. They literally are every day from morning till late afternoon. And they still don't wear a helmet and they still turn, turn left where they're not allowed to and make mistakes and get stopped and pay $15, which is a lot of money for Cameroonian people. Anyway, just to inform you, wear the helmet, obey the traffic rules, traffic signs. If you don't know them, Google them everybody okay let roundabout too they never stop at the roundabout they never let the roundabout flow they make you stop in the roundabout which is completely wrong the person in the roundabout has right of way if you want to come into the roundabout you've got to wait until there's room that's the rules of the roundabout but they don't know and they also don't let people cross the road you have to literally threaten and beg stick your arms out and go crazy to get across the road you see and that's just uh, aggravating because again Pedestrians have right of way everywhere. That's another rule of the road across the globe, everywhere, worldwide, in every single, every single country, whether it's a, it's a zebra crossing or not, it doesn't matter. I can cross the road always, and the cars and motorbikes have to stop. Remember that. Google it. Trust me. All right then. Rob in Cambodia, Siem Reap, loving life, loving it. Love Siem Reap. So glad to be back and happy to have my great life in Cambodia. See you soon. Bye bye. Thanks for watching Rob's Health Crunch. Don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel. There is more great content on the way from me about Cambodia, health, fitness, wellness, real healthy food and great lifestyle habits. Don't forget to enable notifications so you'll know when the latest video is posted. Until then, here's some other great content I think you will enjoy.